of our readers, trust of our brand. You know, if you're just a traditional marketer, if you're a great marketer, you can write great copy and you can pay some money and you can get your ads everywhere in the world. You just have to pay for it. But to be successful in social media, no matter how good you are, people don't trust you. If they're not willing to spread your message virally and share it, it's not going anywhere. That's that. You're never going to have a viral success or a social media success without earning and maintaining the trust and the respect of your community. And you can't start a program of open, honest communications by lying to people or tricking people. That when you, when you violate the trust of the people who you're talking to, all of that positive word of mouth you thought you'd get by taking shortcuts turns on you because people don't like you anymore. And so what this means is that ethics isn't an optional part of your program. It's not something that you add to your social media department later after you launched it. That the ethics portion is the first thing you do when you're creating a social media program. It's where you start. It's where all this stuff comes from. And it, it have, it's this way because it's the right thing to do. And it's this way because it's the only way to be successful.